What we just did is we reeled in a catfish and a smaller walleye. I had about four or five feet of line out behind the boat, and I see something splash behind the boat, and there's a walleye that close behind the chiller. It's uh, really suspended there. Unbelievable. Basically, we can't keep six lines in the water. That's how it's been. We've been out here, what, 20 minutes, maybe? Uh, yesterday, there was four or five times the last couple days, you'd have come over our pot of fish, and all six boards would have fish out of them, or at least four out of the six. Right now, we got four out of the six. We only got two more out. We're going to turn around and swing it back through the pot again. Okay. what we've been doing out here is we're we're fishing anywhere from 10 to 15 feet of water so we're, we're pulling hot and tots quarter or actually there are three sixteenths the older style ones used to be quarter ounce but, well this is a three sixteenths ounce so we're looking at we're, most of the fish are suspended they're anywhere like eight to nine feet down from where we're at and we're all we're doing is we're looking on our book here and we're actually running our baits out 40 feet back that's getting us nine feet down. So we're about the middle of the water column where all the fish are at. So we'll run as, we're running our 40 feet of line out, clipping our offshore board out, and then running them out from there. And then on, what we've been doing is running two boards out or running a flat line. Now on our flat line, we've been running 50 feet back, and we're catching them anywhere from 30 to 50 feet back behind the boards and 55, or 50 to 55 feet back in a flat line. We're pulling cranks right around 2-2, two, 2-3, two, two, sometimes 1-7 to 2 has been hot, but like today the water temperature is 80 degrees, so I mean the fishing's phenomenal out here right now. You could pretty much go out and catch your limited walleyes in no time, but we're pulling cranks fast and we're not using any live bait or anything, but main baits we've been using just hot and tots or number 5 shad wraps have been hot right now. Hey, not really a particular colors have been working. So it's, we're just doing a variety of colors. We're a lot of purple. We catch a lot of fish on purple. A lot of them on chartreuse, fire tiger. Uh, chrome blue has been good. But it's all this, you know, the majority of them are about this, maintain kind of this size of the crankbait that we've been using, 3 16th ounce. A lot of the walleyes that we've been cleaning had the real small two to three inch white bass in them. So we're trying to match the size of the bait fish that are out here. They're, they are, uh, a lot of the fish are, seems like they've been in shallow water versus the deep water. So we're just kind of backing off of the channel on the west side of the channel of it. And we're just going on all the flats and humps where it's the shallower water. And it seems like 90% of the fish are up there feeding. So that's pretty much all we've been doing out there. We've been picking up a lot of big crappies, a lot of white bass, and tons of legal walleyes. Some nice slot fish too, and of course catfish. You can never get away from catfish out here. Any other lake you go to, you got sheephead, you come out here, we got catfish. So that's all pretty much we're doing.